Wazi, Peso, have you had any luck finding seaweed samples for Shellington? Hi, Captain. I'd say we've got every colour of seaweed there is. I can't wait to study each one under the microscope. We'll be there with your seaweed just as fast as we can, matey. See you back at the octopod. Barnacle's out. What do you say we go a wee bit faster to get home? Maybe a little faster would be OK. <laughs> Something's wrong. He's stuck. I can't slow her down or make her stop. Rocks! Yow! I'm... I'm OK. Are you? Aye, but our radio isn't. And the octopod is too far away for us to call them on our helmet radios. Well, matey, the first thing to do is get out and take a look at the gut. Ah, there's a bunch of seaweed stuck in the propeller. I'll pull it out. Let me help. <laughs> <laughs> Got it! Oh, no! No worries. I'll go down and grab the gup finder off the gup. We'll use it to let Captain Barnacles know where we are. So he'll be able to come and save us. Good idea. Is everything okay down there? <sighs> ah, got it! Yes! Yow! Give that back, you scurvy dog! Fish! Stop! That's our gup finder! <gasps> <sighs> now what? Now? We find land. <gasps> land! Come on! Quasi and Peso should be back by now. I'm on it, Captain. Octopod to Quasi and Peso. Their radio's not working, Captain. Activate the gup finder. It'll show us where they are. Hmm. The gup finder shows that they're heading away from the octopod. But they said they'd come home right away. Something's wrong. Sound the Octo Alert. Octonauts, to the launch bay. Octonauts, Quasi and Peso's radio is broken, and the Gup Finder is showing that they're heading away from the octopod. Oh my, they could be lost or in trouble. Professor, I'm going after them. The guppy is ready to go, Cap. Squeak, open the octo hatch. You got it, Cap. I wonder if there's anyone on this island who can help us. Doesn't look like it. Visitors! <laughs> hey! Hello and welcome. What? <clears throat> Down here, my friends. Down here. Welcome to the island where the breeze is cool, the sand is warm, and the fish can walk. Well spotted, my friend. Most fish can't walk on land, but I'm not most fish. I'm a comb tooth Blenny. You can call me Blenny for short. Haha. <laughs> Who are you? We're the Octonauts. I'm Peso. And I'm Quasi. We need to get back home to the octopod as soon as possible. Too bad you can't stay for a while. I was just getting warmed up. See you around. It could take Captain Barnacles a while to find us here, if he could find us at all. Don't worry, me hearty. I learned how to get off a desert island back in me pirate days. All we have to do is build a raft and sail away. Let's do it. I've almost caught up with them. Where's the gup E? Huh? What's that dogfish got? 
You've got the Gup Finder. But that means Quasi and Peso could be anywhere. Time to set sail. Leaving already? Well, till we meet again. Goodbye, me hearty. Nice to meet you. Heave ho, matey. <laughs> <laughs> Sinking. Yeah. Oh. <sighs> ah, our raft is gone. This is a disaster. Don't worry, Peso. I'll think of something else. Wait, I have an idea. Maybe we could send a message for help. That's impossible, me hearty. We've got no radio, no gut finder, nothing. We just need a messenger. We can't get off the island, but we can send a message with someone who can. Huh? Blenny, would you deliver a message to Captain Barnacles on the Octopod and tell them where we are, please? I'd love to, but Blennies like me don't go in deep water. We have to stay in the shallow water around the island, you know? But what if you swim out just far enough to pass the message along to someone else? Hey, that's a great idea. Consider it done, my friends. See? I told you I'd think of something. <sighs> well, this is about as deep as I can go. Oh, hey, excuse me, Bluefish. Spare a minute. Oh, hello. Hi, I need to get a message to the deep. Tell Captain Barnacles that there are two octonauts named Quasi and Peso, and they're stuck on a desert island. I can't swim too deep, but I can pass along the word to some folks who can. Thanks! You're a pal! Oh, hello there, Giant Squid. Can I ask you a favour, please? I need to pass on a message. Tell Captain Barnacles, two Octobots named Crazy and Pesto are stuck in the desert. Need some help? All right, I'll tell me friends. Oh, do got any news? Aye, Anglerfish. Tell Captain Farnacles that some octagons named Lazy and Ernesto are stuck in some dessert. Go as deep as you can and pass it on. Oh, right. Will do. to napkin carbuncles about some octagons named Hay and Presto. They've deserted or they're stuck or something like that. Anyway, pass it on. Octagons stuck? Maybe he meant octonauts. Wait, uh, can you lead me to these octagons? I mean, octonauts? Afraid not, but I can put you in touch with the giant squid what told me about it. Then lead the way. <laughs> The sun is setting. Aye, matey. And it looks like we might have to spend the night here. Or maybe not, my friends. Look! We're oh, over oh, here! Matey. We're over here! Well, I'm looking for a couple of octagons named Hay and Presto. Huh? So the message got a little messed up, but it worked! Yow! <laughs> We're going home! Thank you, Blenny. No problem. Remember, you can count on me to help you out on land or sea. Just drop me a fishing line, call me on my shell phone, or sea mail me. <laughs> Wiz, the home of ABCs, 123s, 
and all your favourite kids TV characters. Now let's find Kids TV. Or I can press this microphone. Whiz. That's how easy it is.